Inclusion for me really is the opportunity for students to be a part of things that they want to be a part of and respected for their um, wants and desire to be a part of it. Jess is a grade 12 student here at West Van who also receives support through our special education program. You know, in grade eight, uh, Jess decided to come out for cross country and track and field. Colin Dignam and Leslie Buchanan uh, really welcomed him with open arms. Both of them give a lot of hours to the athletes that they have in their program and they don't ask for much other than commit, like the commitment and the hard work. They don't, they're not necessarily saying like we have to win and they're not putting those demands on the students but they really encourage students to um, do their best. They don't waver from that standard and I think with Jez Starting in with the track and field and cross country, there was no extra fanfare accommodations made. They really just um, made him feel welcome and supported. And I think that you know our goal of high school athletics shouldn't be winning and losing. It should be about providing an opportunity for students to achieve. And I think um, you know Colin and Leslie are at the forefront of people who are willing to say yes um, to students participating in their in the sports that they coach. Jess is an incredible individual. I'm really going to miss him next year because he's leaving the school because um, he's been with us since grade eight. Uh, he makes you want to come out and coach. He's one of those athletes who's the first one there, last one to leave, thanks you after every practice. Um, he's just a great individual. Really seen him progress um, as an athlete and as a person over the last few years and so I've it's been a pleasure to work with him. I think anybody who gets an opportunity to spend time with Jess will have a special bond with him because he's just that kind of kid. He, um, he's welcoming and he's, he's uh, quick to laugh um, and show what he's enjoying and what he's not enjoying. Um, so Colin and I have, um, have certainly enjoyed having him on the team. Jess has taught me to look for ways of making sure that kids are included and, and it goes beyond the, the cross country team. It's in my classroom, it's in uh, my other um, parts of my life. Um, Jess has, has shown me that you should live every day um, to the fullest and take advantage of whatever opportunities are there for you because um, we're lucky to have those opportunities and we're lucky to be in um, in a place that celebrates uh, diversity and, and really wants the best for everyone. So I've learned to, to kind of appreciate what I have and, and, uh, and having Jess on the, the team is one of those things. Really I want to thank them for their work. I think they work extremely hard and, and track and field and cross country is one of those sports that requires a lot of hours, a lot of technical coaching and a lot and a wide range of coaching. I think that they do an um, amazing job at it uh, and really providing the opportunities for our students to follow their passions in athletics. And I think in this situation Colin and Leslie, uh, the decisions that they've made around other athletes in, in addition to Jess have nothing to do with getting receiving a or accolades. I think they do it because uh, it's the right thing to do and it's an opportunity for students to participate and be involved and uh, try and find something they love, right? And um, in Jess's case, I think he's found something that he, he does love and he works hard at it outside of practice. It's not just a West Van thing that he does, he's working all the time to do it and uh, I think that's a testament to them saying yes.